everyone, so this is my review of Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Season 4, Episode 8, called Laws of Inferno Dynamics. And basically what this episode's about is that when all the lives of all the residents of basically Los Angeles are on the line, both S.H.I.E.L.D. and Ghost Riders are have to work together to try and stop Eli. And this was a very interesting episode that had a lot of kind of like great moments to it, but there wasn't like a lot of overall like story to it. It was more like just cleaning up a lot of like the mess that's been going on throughout most of the season. And I did really enjoy the when the scenes sort of finally came up when Coulson and the director sort of had to come clean to each other about what each other's been doing and what they really kind of think of each other. That was kind of an interesting scene to see that I kind of have been waiting for. And then all the moments with Eli w were very interesting in this episode, where um, you like watch him like slowly go more and more crazy. And I really, really love the scene where um, Daisy, Yo-Yo, and Robbie are about to like break into like this place where where Eli is. And like as Yo-Yo is going through the whole place or that whole like hallway sort of like lights on fire. That was a cool scene to see, like, what Yo-Yo's beliefs as well as Robbie's. And with that, all the scenes with Yo-Yo in this episode were really kind of cool to see, like, her using her abilities to, like, put things sort of in her and her friends' sort of favor. But with that, I feel like they're changing Yo-Yo's abilities a bit too much to where she's more like a sort of like a person with, like, super speed now. Instead of her, like, original abilities when they first meet her, where it was more like kind of like a... Um, speed with like a snapback to it. It's more like she just has super speed now and I don't know really how I feel about that. And then the almost like dark matter like bomb that Eli had in this episode was very interesting even if I couldn't fully understand like what it was or what it did. It just kind of seemed like that based on what I could get from what they were describing. And then Ada in this episode was so great to see and like watch her like evolve more and more. And I'm so happy that her eventual outcome at the end of this episode was basically how I was predicting her outcome would be. So I'm so excited to see what's going to go on with her and see what her storylines are all going to bring out. And the ending fight scene in this episode was kind of hard to follow, but still really kind of cool to see how everyone sort of fit into it and it all like went down. That was so cool to see. And I did like that this episode did end with Daisy sort of becoming an agent again. And the director sort of like accepting her and making her not be a criminal anymore and but be an agent. That was kind of a cool scene to see. But the one scene that I didn't really understand was where um, Daisy and Coulson were talking and it kind of sounded like Coulson wanted Daisy to be the director. And I don't know how that could ever really kind of be a thing. And just overall, this was a really great episode that left so many things up in the air that I'm so excited to see when it comes back in a few weeks. So yeah, that's my review of Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Season 4, Episode 8, called Laws of Inferno Dynamics. So yeah. Bye!